This is our setup. To the left, our motion sensor connected to Raspberry Pi, and to the right, a VAV controller, both of them connected to the same network through a router. And now Priyan is going to explain us more about the user interface and the backend. So, on the user interface, we have a Django application which is integrating into its own database. On the back end, we have a Voltron agent which is listening to the Django application's database and it is trying to schedule the activities based, based on whatever the database changes happens inside those databases. So, um, let's start with our user, we first use case of building data. So, the step one building data is it expecting a file which contains the building information. The building information is mostly related to all the rooms occupied by the building as well as the information of the maximum occupancy expected by the rooms as well as the even the VAV installed in those rooms. So I have a CSV file of building. Let's upload that. Done. After this, we add the registration data. So in any educational institution, there are courses which are being scheduled at every time. Like in fall or in winter, there, are, there is a schedule of activities going on inside those rooms. So right now, what we are trying to do is uh, upload the registration information and then we connect it to the building data which, which we just recently uploaded. So let's connect this. So let's right now go to giving some, you can see here that there is true information given by the occupancy sensor and based on that the VAV will rotate to its damper position whichever had been calculated and you can even see right now the VAV moving so that it gets to the appropriate calculated amount of the position which it has been decided while we uploaded both the building as well as registration data. This was our project, a little demo of our first use case of inserting things into the database. Thank you.